Hey, so I've been playing around stuff on Unreal Engine 5 and just want to make this quick tutorial because I assume it's an issue a lot of people are running into. I saw it on the forums and there wasn't really a good answer. Um, but so I have like multiple characters on this project. Um, you know, I have, I'll go here, first version BP, blueprints. So I have just a normal one. I have one with a grapple, one that can wall run. Um, and when I was like deleting, I was deleting the initial character and trying to put new ones in and my character would basically fall through the map. Um, and so that's happened to a lot of people and a lot of people think that you just have to like move the main camera like this, but that's actually um, not how it works because the, this network player start overrides it. So I was moving around like the floor and stuff and I saw this little like game icon, which you'll see up here, uh, this little game icon and I saw it in the floor and then I remember that that's what I changed before. So. If you can't find it, you can just um, go to window and then click checkbox on world outliner and you can search for network player start. Um, and then if you click this, it should come up and you should be able to move where it is. Um, like you'll at least be able to find it on the map. Um, you can move it around and stuff and move it to the right spot so your player will spawn in. And the player it'll spawn in is down here in world settings and it'll be whatever character you pick. So. Like I have first person character grapple for this one. Um, so when I spawn in, it's grapple hook character. Um, and then if I were to change that to first person, just the default first person character, um, spawn in and no grapple. So just a normal running character. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I know a lot of people had that issue with the players falling through the map and stuff. Uh, so just want to make this video.